we obtained a vast trove of never before seen tax information on the wealthiest individuals in America. This is not waitresses or plumbers. It's not even doctors or lawyers. This is the 1% of the 1%. I'd often heard, as we're covering the IRS, the agency doesn't leak, which was true until this happened. So the first thing that really became clear to us was these are some of the wealthiest people in the world. And if you look at how much they are worth and how much they're paying in taxes, they're not paying that much in taxes. And when you look at their wealth growth compared to the taxes paid, an extraordinary picture emerges. Some of these guys can pay zero. It's hard to beat paying zero in taxes. I mean, it's taxes, right? So you have to use every possible way you can to try to get through to, to people and make it visual and relatable and as much narrative as you can squeeze out of the story. Warren Buffett, wealth has grown so much and he's paid so little in income tax that he's probably the greatest tax avoider in American history. Peter Thiel secretly amassed a $5 billion Roth IRA. A Roth IRA is a middle-class retirement savings vehicle and there's supposed to be limits on it. We are actually aware in doing this story that there was legal risk for us as an organization. You are writing stories about literally the deepest pockets in the world. And we appreciated working at a place where we felt like somebody had our back and we weren't gonna back down just because we got a nasty gram from some billionaire. Our stories have engendered bills in Congress. It doesn't really get any better than having the White House propose a law that's deeply influenced by your story. We have a system that allows the ultra wealthy in a legal way to avoid taxes. And so they can avoid contributing to society. And that is corrosive to our democracy. To the extent that I can cover it and keep an eye on it and push back at these grave risks, I feel privileged to be able to do so. We felt like this was a once in a lifetime or once in a generation opportunity to explore this information. So we took seriously the idea that we were doing this on behalf of basically everyone else.